in humans, a large portion of the cranium is composed of the single frontal bone and the two parietal bones. The frontal bone is complex and makes up part of the orbit and possesses a sinus. Obviously, the great expansion of the frontal and parietal bones in humans has allowed the expansion of the human brain. The parietal bone was a prominent bone in the cranium in the earliest bony fish whose fossils are known. The frontal bone's existence is a bit more questionable. There are a number of small bones whose homology uh, is not certain, but certainly the parietal bone is an ancient bone. By amphibians, paired frontal bones existed as well, and the frontal and parietal bones made up the major part of the dorsal cranium. In frogs, the frontal and parietal bones fuse to make a frontoparietal bone. By the amniotes, the frontal bone is incorporated into the eye socket, and the frontal bone expands, developing a slope as we observe it in mammals.